Hi friends, welcome back to another video. Today I am just doing a little summer night routine in my life, showing you guys what I do, my evening routine. Right now in the summer when there's honestly not too much going on for me. <laughs> just thought I just had dinner, kind of ended my day. It is now, it is 7 o'clock right now. I really want to shower. I have to wash my hair. I went to the pool today. I actually didn't get in so like my hair is not like dirty with chlorine. I just feel like it's kind of sweaty and honestly it's been a couple of days. Oh yeah it's been a week since I've washed it. Today's Thursday. I think the last time I washed it was Thursday so it's been a week so it's definitely needed. All right just got out of the shower. I realized I like got a little burnt on my chest and my back for being at the pool but that's fine i'm just going to real quickly do my hair so all i did was wash and condition it i used the raw sugar volume revive shampoo and conditioner and then when i get out of the shower i have the raw sugar mighty cream leave in conditioner not too much i am a less is more person with product but i just kind of like finger comb that through my hair and then a little bit of the not your mother's curl talk and I like put that in and then do a little bit of scrunching. With the cream, I kind of like scrunch the excess water out and then I'm just going to like take my towel to it. So I am just use like a towel. I don't have like anything fancy, but I just kind of very gently dry it. That's kind of the key. So I just kind of like wring the water out like that and then do a little bit of scrunching and then it's all good. Oh, I almost forgot lotion, but I am going to go and lotion up my whole body now because I like, shaved my legs and everything, so I have to put my lotion on. I'm back from the shower. I just put on a clean big t-shirt, and after I do my hair routine, I really just I let it air dry, just put it back. But I'm just going to do my nighttime skincare routine. Start with my glow recipe toner. Honestly, I haven't been using this as much. It definitely helped. I got really bad blackheads around my nose, but I got my nose piercing and I kind of like stopped putting it on because I like, obviously I think like when I first got the nose piercing, I probably shouldn't be putting any product on it so it doesn't get infected, but I just kind of got out of the habit of putting this on. So I need to get back at it because I can notice my blackheads are getting worse. They were better when I was using that regularly. So honestly, my skincare routine does change a little bit every day, just kind of depending on like how my skin is feeling. So I'm going to do my little ordinary niacinamide and hydraulic acid drops. Mm. I got my nail. Okay, now I have this little, I don't know, it's like a little sample, but it's called the Beet Glow Boosting Serum. So, I don't know, you're definitely supposed to get like a little pad or something for this. I just kind of like, you know, and then kind of just put that all over to kind of help my skin get a little bit more of a natural glow. I'm assuming this basically does the same thing as like a vitamin C serum or something, I'm not sure. Okay, then after I do my serums, I do my jade roller to really help get everything in and also just like give myself a nice little massage Ugh. all right and then i just finished with moisturizer and right now i've been using the bubble slam dunk okie dokie and that is my nighttime skincare routine and now i'm all done yeah now i'm gonna find something else to do <laughs> So it's been a couple of hours, like two hours since I last talked to you, I think. It's now like 9.30, oh, almost 9.45. And so my mom and I went on a walk and then we just watched some Sex and the City for a little bit. And we had some wine and I may have had a little too much wine. 
but that's okay now it's like that was like my evening routine now we're getting started into like the night routine i like graduated from downstairs i am up in bed so what i need to do um i need to brush my teeth that's like the hygiene routine thing i need to do i still haven't done that i had to do that earlier but i need to do that i also this is something i like to do um kind of like right before i crawl into bed and like really call it at night but just do like a little bit of cleaning in my room it's not like a disaster right now there's a bunch of like just junk on my bed but i'll move that um what i need to do is fold my laundry you can kind of see that and then also i want to empty my trash so i just have like a trash bag i don't know i like doing a little bit of cleaning right before i go to bed it helps like helps me feel a little less stressed a little more relaxed before i go to sleep so i'm gonna go do those little chores right now and then just some more fun things after we get some more business items out of the way. I finished my cleaning and honestly that kind of like really tuckered me out um <laughs> I'm like super tired now so I'll probably go to bed really shortly it's like almost 11 o'clock I filled up my water bottle and that is such a must so if I had more energy I was going to play The Sims I'm kind of exhausted so I think I'm just gonna like watch tv or youtube i also have like my bedside activities table or box or whatever this little box or basket just has various little pre-bedtime activities i like to kind of do like fun screen time like playing video games um but then also having some non-screen options because i try to like you know have like 30 minutes before i go to bed without the screens to like help me sleep but i'm going to braid my hair and then I don't know put on something my laptop is just right here so I'll find a little show or something because my youtube feed is so weird how to beat the death traps when saw was just recommended to me I've never like actively wanted to know that but I guess cool okay I'm gonna braid my hair I try doing this every night just like a french braid just to help keep my hair out of my face Okay, do I watch How to Beat the Saw, Death Traps, or Criminal Minds? I feel like those are pretty similar vibes. Okay, I think I'm just gonna end it. I'm going to watch my movie and get all snuggled up in bed. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this vlog, seeing a like pretty normal night in my life. I feel like it's usually a little more interesting. Usually I wouldn't be going to bed at like 10.30. But hey, you know, like I'm actually just like really healthy and like a really stylish influencer like that so yeah anyway bye guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe follow me on the social medias all the info is down below and i will catch you in the next one adios